All right, everybody, welcome back to another channel anniversary. It is I, Zalistar, and today it has been four years, actually, since the birth of the channel kind of thing, or since the channel has started, and a lot has happened, pretty much. So, uh, so I think the first level, like, I think the first thing that I did is that I showed off, I think, my Minecraft and I think my Oblivion my early stages of my oblivion mod and then slowly from there i sort of just expanded upon that kind of thing so this time uh we're gonna be doing something different and i want to kind of just explain how this is going to work kind of thing because i know for a fact that this might go poorly or it might go really weird or something like that but allow me to explain how this is going to work and I want to make sure that everybody is on the level of what's going on, right? So, how how this is... Uh, so, what the channel anniversary is going to be is that I'm going to be releasing all of my scripts. Not at once, but as many as I can do. Uh, like, and it'll be periodically throughout the year kind of thing. If I find some time and I don't have anything... Let's say, like, I have over a bunch of videos kind of thing, and I'm like, you know what? I can kill, like, 30 minutes kind of thing. I'll do one of the scripts kind of thing. So how the scripts are going to be is that they're going to be as as you can see them kind of thing in the overall series. Now, if there are items that are broken or items that are still work in progress, I will not be doing their scripts until I have been able to fully work them out and be... And like they they're in full working order, I I trust that they won't break anybody's character or anything else like that. Uh, I'll also be giving tutorials on kind of like how the script works. We'll be running through like from top to bottom how they work. I'll be giving credits to the people who actually did help me, uh, being able to kind of work around this heap of mess kind of thing that is my mod kind of thing, and. Uh, yeah, so uh, while they're credited, don't go and uh, so I'm so while I'm giving them recognition for them helping me out with a lot of the crazy shenanigans that I do go with, I have to stress that do not bother them uh, because of the fact that like while I myself will sort of like message them from time to time when I break a script and I I just can't I just can't read uh, what's going on. Uh, that doesn't mean, though, like, hey, everybody, if you have modding issues, go to these guys. That's not what that means. Uh, if you do ever want to make a mod and you do want to have support or help for it, go to the Nexus Mod Forums. Uh, I'll leave a link to that in the description below. Uh, that will be for uh, more or so. I think, it's, I think it's just construction set, but I might be wrong. It might be construction set script extender as well. So there's that as well. Uh, so I'm gonna. Ch uh, so another thing that I wanted to mention though is that like I'm gonna try and bunch up a lot of the scripts together, if they all overlap. So for instance, uh, as a, as of right now, I can tell you though that all of these are gonna be bunched up into one. So while these items right here are all different, uh, all have their own separate script though, but in the video they'll all be the same same op like they'll be all in the same script but they, they are labeled uh what they are attached to but they're all identical because these ones i think are the same and same idea with this over here as well my birth sign potions they're all identical they're, they just give you different abilities and such that's all that that's all that is right so any of the ones that I just purely ripped from uh, Vanilla Oblivion, I'm not going to be releasing or I'm not going to be putting in my name kind of thing and all that. Obviously, I'm not going to be putting my name on all of them because while I did work on a lot of them heavily, uh, it's already sort of applied because it's on my paste bin kind of thing. I'm thinking that's where I'm going to put it. Uh, like, like it's on my paste bin. You know who the author is. Most, mostly it's me, but with some assistance with other people. So that's where that comes into play, though. Uh, I think I already talked about that they're all going to be linked together. Yes, so 
while this video will be the first in the playlist, uh, the playlist will be public, but all the videos will be unlisted. Uh, the reason for that is because while I'm going to be periodically updating the series behind the scenes kind of thing, uh, I do not want to spam people about these videos, though. So while they will be unlisted, they will be released periodically. So what I recommend is that if there's an item in which that you are looking for that you want the script for or to find out how it works kind of thing, uh, I recommend to just bookmark the 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 video uh, playlist or better yet uh if you want you can just bookmark the paste bin i'll try and make it public apparently i might have messed up on one of them where i think it's one of the, the maze things i think i forgot to public that apparently but i'll go do that uh after this but uh yeah i think that's pretty much everything for the most part so while this won't be for well, right now I have about, uh, I think from what I read, I think I had like 260 something odd scripts running uh, from my mod. Now, a lot of those are from vanilla and not only that, uh, remember all of these are separate scripts, right? So I think all together, there'll be about 100 videos, give or take. And again, I'm going to be bunching them up together. So the armor and such will be bunched up together. This one will be very interesting because uh, it has an item that's attached to it, which is, of course, this. Uh, this will be its own video, though. I can definitely tell you that much. Because while this is supposed to work around with this, I don't want it to be the same video. They'll definitely be separate. But while this is still a work in progress, uh, as of right now, it's now less broken, but it's still broken. And same idea with every other script. Uh, some scripts will be, of course, separate depending on what they what they do and how they work. Uh, I'll be going through, like, if any of them have a random variable or a random uh, or a random thing that that's not in the script, kind of thing. I'll explain what it is and what it's for and how it works, kind of thing, and what it's supposed to do or how it's supposed to help the script move along, kind of thing. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to try and make it as beginner as possible. I'm also going to try and make it as a, as clear as you can just copy and paste it into the into the uh, construction set. So that way, though, you can use it and it'll work kind of thing. Uh, the only thing is that, like, while these, ver like, uh, some scripts obviously will have an extra variable that's not placed within the script. And... Like, I, I can even show you what, uh, one of them right now. So, one of the uh, one of the things that I have is Soul Link. Alright? So, while this one will be a part of the Dark King stuff, uh, one of the variables that it has that is not actually a part of Soul Link's script, but is actually considered a global variable. What that means is that no matter what you can do, you can do this. I don't need to capitalize everything. I don't think I need to capitalize it, but I like capitalizing it just so I know that it has the correct spell. So this is the global variable. Uh, AXM, max health. We can look at it, and it has a variable. All right, so you can also do it with a different variable type, but I want to wait until those videos come out, right? But this is what I mean, though. So this variable right here is not stored within the script. It is stored within the mod, if, I, if my thinking is indeed correct. So the mod stores uh, the variable name and the, I guess, not really the value. I think that's more so handled within the save itself. But the variable itself is uh, like is stored within the, the mod itself. So like the AXM max health here is stored within the thing. And I think it's default value, no matter what you do, is zero unless you change it. I didn't change it. I, don't, I didn't change any of them. But that's the idea, right? So... There's that too. So I'll prob. Uh, so again, that's all that. So pretty much just keep an eye out. I mean, if you want, one thing that I kind of like to do is that I like to, uh, depending on who, depending on whose YouTube channel I, I want to watch. Uh, sometimes I go to their. I type in not not the playlist, but I. 
but I always uh, copy the, the link kind of thing. And then what I'll do is I'll paste it over and over again. So though it's one of my first recommended ones when I start typing it in, you can do that too. I just recommend bookmarking it or whatever your browser kind of allows you to save a link so you can look at it later. Uh, I definitely recommend that if you want, because obviously not. Uh, I'm not going to upload 90 videos in one day. I'll try and keep. I'll try and record some before uh, August 8th, which is the, which is today's date, and there will be normal scheduled videos as of today, kind of thing. This will be uploaded on, at noon, so take a look at that playlist. I'm going to be making it after I'm done. After this is done, so all you need to do is just go to that playlist link. I'll give a brief explanation in the description of that too. But the idea is that you look at there, uh, the video title will be whatever the script that you're looking at is. It'll be probably what the item name is. And pretty much it'll also have an indicator of what it requires. So my scripts do not require script extender, but in the future I do wanna use those or I do wanna make them. So in the, the, in the title, it'll tell you if it's vanilla. Vanilla means that you just need script extender only. That's it. It'll run the base game. It doesn't require any other mods or any other like external things. It just needs script extend. It just needs a construction set. Whereas if I were to say, uh, I think it's C S S E, I think, or something like that. I'll just put OBSC. I think it'll just be simple for that. That tells you that you need the construction set script extender to even use the script or to be able to make the script in the first place or be able to copy paste it because construction set won't even register those scripts but pretty much that's all that is there uh anything else i missed it'll probably be in the description of this video uh oh something i also forgot to mention uh the videos will also have a link to the paste bin in their description and the uh, scripts when they go public kind of thing they'll have a link to the video as well so you can link the video to so that you get a brief understanding of what the scripts actually do so they'll be linking each other kind of thing so you can see what both is so uh, yeah so that's gonna be it uh, I'm glad for another year uh, so far we've almost reached uh, 300 as of this recording which is awesome I'm really happy despite the fact that I'm not really, I don't really show it, but I'm actually very uh, happy beyond anything. I'm, yeah, all right. So I'll see you guys next time for another year with me, Zalstar. And I'll see you guys next time for uh, another year of this uh, YouTube channel.